All right, so I gotta start it off. Hell yeah, welcome to my channel. Uh, I'm here today with my good friend Carlos Tipiani to help me make a video that I've been trying to make for myself. He's a comedian here in Portland and also a friend of mine. What up? Hell yeah. So if you are one of my nine subscribers, <laughs> hell yeah then you might know that we are booking a tour and part of this tour we are going to look for and meet other YouTube creators uh, to help them make you to make videos or to make a collaboration for their channel or for our channel with Motorcoat, the band we're taking on tour. Uh, hell yeah. So, so for part of this uh, we're going to, I found a website, we can search YouTube by city. Okay. And then uh, so today we're going to do Chico, California because we have a, bo a show booked, we've got in touch with some bands, we've got that whole thing lined up, and now I want to meet some people in the morning and shoot some stuff with them. Cool. What are we going to shoot? Very open. Like, so what we're going to do is go to YouTube results from Chico okay. and look at like 20 or 30 channels and like everybody think like, what could we do with them? Sure. Well, I don't know if the nine subscribers know, but I mean, I've seen you do protest videos. I've seen you do like uh, trailer kind of commercial videos, music videos, videos of our comedy shows. Um, you edited together an entire comedy show into like a little, you know what I mean? It was like a trailer, like a little clip of everybody. You know, it was real cool. <coughs> Hell yeah. Um, so there's a lot that's possible and capable of being done uh, with the resources and technology available. So I'm definitely excited to see what we can do. <laughs> Hell yeah. And so before I pulled you into this mess, I did do a test run, you know, on my own time. And I called, I pulled up Ashland, Cal, uh, Ashland Oregon, because okay. they, they had a show secure there. So I went on, and I actually found a 17-year-old rapper okay. who's put up some videos, but he doesn't have any of his own. He, like, kind of just raps, and he has pictures and stuff, you know? Sure. And so we've hit him up, and we might go down and make a music video with him. Wow. And have, like, the band, like, give him some live music. Nice. Hell yeah. Nice. And also, we hit up a yoga guy who we're going to come down, and they're going to do, like, so he's going to have something planned. We, I suggested, like, a, a breathing uh, demonstration, like, proper yeah. breathing technique or, like, a yoga instruction. Yeah, I like that. And he's totally down. And so much so that he's already called me back and he's like, hey, I want to have you guys come and play at our place at the end of the tour. Nice. And I'll have like my congregation nice. there. Hell yeah. So you'll we'll have so uh, that led show to a show. close out yeah, the tour. So I got those two and I probably only sent like, probably only hit up like three or four people. So like wow. pretty good returns. And since it's all DIY shit anyway, like everybody's yeah. just kind of down to collab. I like it. Hell yeah. I like the positive response. I was going to say it's better than my dating profile. I sent out like 170 responses and I think I got back two. So we're doing good. We're doing good. I'm better than Carlos. <laughs> okay, hell yeah. So, uh, if you just want to take a look here, that's yeah, like, that's, that's the recording just... fucking thing. Oh, I didn't click start. Recording. That's okay. Yeah, so all those across the top there, okay. those are all I've already pre-opened from Chico's results where I just clicked last 30 days okay. and I did not put any like keywords, just only last 30 days, uh, very like 10 kilometers from so Chico. So is it just pulling up, because this one has 62 subscribers, it's just kind of more amateur based uh, content creators? Absolutely. I'm sure when we pull through this stuff, you're, I mean, when I was looking in Ashland, most of the results were like kids under nine who were just like had the phone and they're like, hey, YouTube. <laughs> zero subscribers, zero yeah. views. Yeah. Like it's, it starts to get kind of bad. Yeah. Of like how many people have zero views. But yeah, sure. this channel does not have zero views. So <laughs> we're in the game, man. All right. So I'm going to just go ahead and pull this up. Uh, this was the first one I saw. It was a guy in Chico, a kid in Chico. I already left him a comment, uh, but he is at a skate park, which when I first talked to Motorcoat uh, in one of our early interviews I did for another YouTube channel I was working with a year ago, uh, they mentioned they would love to play shows at like skate parks and bike parks. Yeah. Like they're way down with that. 
That's also another music video opportunity there. Uh, Sum 41 has a really nice music video like that. These kids are good. They That's can't exactly see the video, what I right? was thinking. It's just we, only we can see it. Oh, no, they'll be able to see it. Okay, okay. I'm yeah, these yeah, kids I'm are good. I like it, and I could see you know the the live he band going young. there. Um, right. So I was right. Just what you said. Lot we could shoot live band music video with skate trick videos, and then just interlay the interlay two. them. Yeah, edit it together, and it'll it'll work out. It really works good. for both. They can share with theirs. We can share with ours. Yeah, it's like a both yeah introduced. Yeah, I Hell like yeah. that. Yeah. So this kid. Okay. So what I do next is I'll click on here. And so he hasn't filled anything out. So a lot of times there's like a thing that's like details or about me. Right, right. Contact. He hasn't Can filled any of that up. One of these? Oh, yeah, here you go. Oh, Sorry, I was just being stingy. You're fine. I meant to pass it to you like four times. Had the thought, didn't do it. It's fine, we got a lot going on. Hell yeah. Okay, so Jacob Elliott, I, he's pretty rad. I've left him a comment. This, look, two views, zero likes. Anything we watch, I'm going to click like on. And we probably should make a point uh, to leave wow. some. Wow. Yeah, hell yeah. That was good, yeah. <coughs> I like it. And I like the quality. I mean, I know I'm, I've already seen the videos that you made for us and stuff like that. So I think it'd be beneficial for everybody. These kids are doing really cool tricks. You make some real uh, video and capture shots of what they're doing. They're doing pretty good with whatever they're using. I just Yeah, they're killing it. Help, yeah, right? hell yeah. <laughs> Whatever we do, we could do something, you know, to to lend some of our talent. I'm just going to close him because I already left him a comment. And sure. when those channels are, like, low views and stuff like that, uh, he's posting every day. He'll see that comment. He'll hit us back for sure. And we'll be able to engage him real easy. Uh, okay, so we got Barrel Aged is the name of this channel. Okay, see, they've got all this stuff. Uh, they... They they haven't really filled it out though. <laughs> they have they have one v four views one day. You're a hit. This might just be a band. Black here. Uh, this uh, like band. Like I said, check us out. Uh, we got First subscriber, here. what's up, Barrel Age? Thanks for coming out. You know who it is right here. Uh, half uh, half uh, me. Half I'll on subscribe here. I'll do it on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Hundred and thirty eight followers on Facebook though. Oh, doing it's on right. Facebook. I'm I'm dumb. I'll do the YouTube thing later, I got it. <laughs> you know what I like about this already if you're trying to work with them is uh, you see my camera which is not as good as yours. Yeah. I like to take a lot of general purpose footage. If you did that, you know what I mean? Uh tree yeah. especially here in Oregon, uh, go up to the the gorge, go up to Canticleer Point, get trees, birds, whatever. So you have general purpose footage. You roll. So they play their yeah. music and you can kind of chop and edit that. You know yep. what I mean? I yep. think that would work. This nature, isn't like overly, highway. Yeah, this isn't overly hard music. You'd be able to, you know, do some nature and uh, make them a really... Because this is just them performing live, which, you know, nothing against that. But again, you'd be able to bring a lot to... Uh, yeah to help where one you're editing videos and getting the satisfaction of the practice the work the utilization of the equipment getting your name out there and then helping them because yeah they have what one video this could be uh yeah more. they're they're getting started though uh Guys got some he reminds me of my hair. buddy. Yeah, I know exactly. Look at those Beautiful. jeans, bro. Oh, oh, look at her. Look at her She's dancing. Hell yeah. She's into it. I'm telling you. Catapult these guys to start them. Wow, she's really good. It reminds me of... How do I How do I leave a comment? They could have turned it off. Uh, were you there? We went to the, the brewery. The Irish brewery. Feckin'. Uh, and a young lady, I have to look up her name, I can't put it out right now because I can't remember. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, but no, she was magnificent. Watched a star be born. She was great. 
What was the? What was it? It was a mixed open mic. Uh, oh, music, mic. music and uh, comedy. Comedy. Too. Yeah. But it was good. Like the musicians were actually good. It wasn't one of those open mics where it was just painful. Like comedy is good. The music was good. And uh, how do you like those mixed mics? I like that one. Cause I've been to a mixed mic where it was supportive, and yeah. I can't say, you know, I'm glad to be in a supportive room, but quite frankly, some of the people were fucking terrible. I mean, some of the music was just god awful, and we, <laughs> we cheered and supported anyway. Yeah, but right. Didn't, Community. They didn't enjoy it, and uh, it's kind of the same as comedy. I mean, there's some people, some just amateurs here, yeah. that when people say, who's my favorite, you think I'm going to say somebody from SNL. But my favorites are local people here. I love some of these people. Right. So some of it I like I it, some that. of it I don't. I oh, yeah. I'm still supportive. I still, you know, cheer. Uh, but I like I like this mix mic at the Irish Brewery because it was very quality music. Um, I performed uh, a couple other people. I think it went well. The open How were the mic, musicians as audience? Um, they were good. They were good. Like it was a good audience all around. People were. I don't think it was just supportive. People enjoyed it. People enjoyed my comedy. I enjoyed their music. Mm -hmm. It was it was genuine appreciation. I'm not just saying, oh, they were good because they were good. <laughs> nah, like the fucking song was good. The guy could put out an album. I think you know I'd probably download it or whatever. Um, and that's what I'm saying. Like these guys could use help like that too. Uh, maybe I put I'll put you in touch with those bands because just stuff like that. Getting people's name out there. This young lady, she was there with her family. I have to look her up. I have her dad added on Facebook, <laughs> and uh, they loved it because you know my Mormon jokes. And I'm from I am I was right. raised Mormon. You, anybody can make a Mormon joke, but I was raised a Latter Day Saint. Right. And so they liked it. We got to talking, but his daughter was uniquely talented. Like, what do we say in this day and age? American Idol, good. Like, she was amazing. A star wow. being born. Wow. And she's this young girl. American Idol good. Yeah, she was. Wow. She's, she's this young girl who's saying uh, amazing. And she's kind of charming and funny too. Because people throw out a suggestion. They're like, sing Freebird. And she's all, never. I'll never sing it. And so then, she had good attitude. Yeah, she, she was funny. She was funny. And then she, and she sang great. Hell yeah. Let's see, man. Hell yeah. Well, let's pull up some more. And then we'll, we can. That was kind of cool. We just let the song play. That's good for everybody. And we got a little chat in. Yeah, That'll be awesome. That's good, because people like to talk over games. I don't know, maybe they'll be... We'll see. Next. We're subscribed. There was nothing to hit them up on there, though. Yeah. They didn't allow us to leave a comment. <laughs> they didn't leave an email address. <laughs> but they are on Facebook. They have 138 likes. Carlos, find them. I'll find them later, and I'll hit them up. Tell them what we saw. And maybe even just dropping them those notes, like, hey, we found you, but we couldn't... We had to take extra steps to contact you. Maybe just hit put your booking email on there. Right. If we found you, maybe somebody else will. Maybe that'll be helpful enough as like you know. Yeah. When you when you make fucking break ice with somebody, you want to know. You know, you want them. Well, because even if you're not, you don't like, want to be asking for something. Yeah, because you may not be like touring the country, but if you're booking local shows or you want to be doing any type of shows. You're going to want to put your information out, an email, a contact of some kind. Do you uh, have any information like that on your profile? No, I just barely started making all mine, and I don't think anybody even really follows any. I have a Twitter. I don't know. That's how they I all feel. A, they have no... That is probably how they no, feel. We're their first subscriber. Yeah. I think I have like 40 views. I have views, but uh, <clears throat> right now none of my videos are mine. They're my friends. My friends requested that I upload <coughs> the videos of them. Um... So my biggest hit right now is Ron, my sweet little friend Ron Melamed, all the way out of New Jersey. And what, what, is, what? What, what is the video? Uh, it's stand up, but it's Ron stand up, and it's hit, and he's got like forty. You post or, other comics on your. No, my friends requested that I put their videos, the ones they asked me to film or whatever. Okay. But the thing is, I'm sure you know. I don't know if the audience fucking. I'm, I'm allowed to swear. Yeah, I don't know if people YouTube. know. Um, you just can't pull your dick out. That's about it. And, and, <laughs> hold on, we must bow to Apple. Apple, please, please never demonetize. No. Please never take us off. We bow to you. Okay. On to uh, Chico. That was yeah, our... Yeah, right on. Are please, Apple, children? please. We bow to Apple first. Was, please let Apple seize the means of production, please. Okay. 
Little kids now? Okay, we're not going to look at little kids. So we've had this kid up on the screen that whole discussion that called my squad. We'll give you the subscribe. <laughs> That's hilarious. Denise Parker. Hey, 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 guys. Happy Friday. Um, I just wanted to uh, just do a short little intro she looks video. Like she's in a trailer. Thank you for joining me. Um, this feeling. channel is really all about natural living, um, chemical free living, Jesus, sobriety, and positivity. I like all that. Um, those are as some long things as we that have been don't count. my journey on um, becoming the best version of me. And I feel um, in my heart that this is really where everybody needs to be. So I just wanted to encourage you to um, check in from time to time and check out what I'm sharing. It's going to um, all be about Young Living products, which are chemical free, um, whether that be for our skin, for um, whether that be makeup, personal care, um, okay. uh, cleaning. Um, that all sounds pretty cool. Essential oils, uh, pretty much everything. <coughs> okay, let's see what she's Looks actually like she's kind of got here. like a store going though, right? Let's see. Hey, how are you guys? So I, I just want to hop on here and share um, a trick means. that I just learned from another gal online. Um, we love our thieves, and I don't know how well you're going to be able to see this. Um, the lighting is so oh, stinking bad. I, I have passing. not figured out my lighting issue. Oh, thieves is the brand. Okay. There we go. Let's do that. Okay, so this is our thieves. <coughs> if, if the hack is to just free. put more water in it. Dish soap. So Let's no um, SLS, so, so sodium lauryl Two sulfates, no dyes, no SLES, no formaldehyde, <laughs> no phosphates, no synthetic perfumes. Don't read what's this not in it. Tell me what's in it. <laughs> Pure therapeutic, top of the line essential oils. Yeah, well, so, look, this poison um, contains no cyanide, about, no arsenic. Um, cleaners, plant-based cleaners, is that they don't set very well. <laughs> um, ours is extremely concentrated. So one of the things I want to share with you. Oh look, this there's the other one she stole right it from. It's around fourteen dollars, and you know, to me at first it was like, why would I spend fourteen bucks on dish stole, soap when I can get it But she's calling it a thief. Well, so for one, we're trying to go toxin free. Two, um, this is not just one bottle. This is actually you can split this up between three bottles. So <laughs> take a third of this. You're going to take the other two thirds out, put it answer. into a separate container. If it's um, not so water it down. Containers for this. <laughs> my, so all my money is on water it down. Then you're going to add a teaspoon of baking soda because we all know baking soda is good for our um, cleaning. Um, so then a teaspoon soda. of baking soda. And what I would suggest actually is taking that teaspoon of baking soda and adding it to some really hot water and getting mm. it to dissolve first. Oh, okay. okay? And then, so then you're going to put that in here and you're going to fill the rest up with water. Ah, oh, water it down. So the sure age old thievery trick. Snow. Baking, that there's yeah. no baking soda sitting on the okay, bottom. Okay, lady. I still wouldn't have added the baking soda. So, so I guess that's cool. what other things can we help her uh, hack in such a way? I don't know. I'm not good at these life hacks. I'm not a very good... Stretch your weed. Mix in some oregano. It's much cheaper. <laughs> Buy it in the bulk section. Wow. That's super fucked up. <laughs> Start putting in nutmeg, yeah. Okay, look. If you've got a bag of Coke and you want to stretch it, what I say is... You go get that Arm & Hammer. How much Coke do you have and how much Coke do you want? You got an eight ball? Hey, you can stretch that thing into a big block like this. Just like that. It can last you a very long time. You just you just pour that eight ball right in that Arm & Hammer, right in the top, tear it open, shake it, shake it, shake it, pour it all out. You sell that to all your friends. Tell them I'm this never is the good stuff. Any anything you sell me ever again. All right. If you don't like baking soda, if the kid, if they catch on to the baking soda, try baby laxatives. That's a thing. That's okay. A thing. Uh, here's another thing. If you gotta sell weed by the weight, you put that shit in your in your crisper in the refrigerator. It'll soak up all the moisture, and then you it will weigh double triple. Is that really correct? Yeah. If you well, yeah. The water weight's like. Hell yeah. All right, we're on to the next. Bitch. All right, just moving on. <laughs> yeah, we can keep going with that forever. But I got too onto the topic of drugs, <laughs> and my mind was still stuck there. So, That's so funny. Okay, Stephanie the stylist, she looks uh, like a very young child. Uh, this is probably just the mother of this girl, but we are just going to not subscribe because I don't want to look at that. Sorry. Evelyn Valencia. I don't get it. 
Do you? I don't. Really yeah, see this is game. probably like a kid. It looks like they're playing a game or something. Jenny Joy. Nope, she's got nothing going. Okay, look at this. Here we go. We got a preacher a or something. Sunday homily. The priest. Sunday. Do you know what homily means? Fuck no. Is it a song? I don't know. Poem? You're a fucking Mormon. I thought you would know. Look at this. Wow, yeah, this guy's that, that this guy's me, badass. That cuts me real deep. Okay, let's check this out. <laughs> <laughs> I said you're, you're a Mormon. You don't even know what a what a <laughs> homily <laughs> is. Saint Mark, Jesus came. Homily is disciples. food, but again, the crowd gathered, making it impossible for them even to eat. When his relatives heard of this, they set out to seize him, for they said he is out of his mind. And the scribes who had come from Jerusalem said he is possessed by Beelzebul. And by the prince of demons, he drives out demons. Summoning them, he began to speak to them parables. How can Satan drive out Satan? If a kingdom is divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. So, is it just kind of like online sermons? He only has a few of them. He's rolling, though. He's got... He's on a computer or a laptop. I really wanted to see if I could move my 921 subscribers. Go yeah, follow this guy's going, man. Dude, I have like So I'm trying none. for the very first time to create this video <laughs> using uh, my uh, iOS uh, device. He's like got a fucking walkthrough how to make a video on an iPad. Luma Fusion. So I'm going to see if I can actually Okay, let's see what this is. Check the, they gather, that's what we could be doing. Um, that's, see awesome his green screen's coming hear, through right here. Uh, yeah, what the, all that's the hilarious. New ideas are coming from places like his Apple hair's all fucked up other, in it uh, too. You know, software, <laughs> or not software manufacturers, but but people who build the hardware, uh, because uh, basically uh, the the tablets and the phones and the computers that we have today um, are they have a very short lifespan. Um, in fact, yeah. uh, Dr. Jordan Peterson said something kind of interesting. Uh, he said that the laptop that we have now, the laptop that you have now, is sort of like a leaf on a tree. It has a very short season. Um, and so, you know, uh, we look at... Uh, <laughs> That's hilarious. The image. The image. Yeah, yeah exactly. Whether it's your phone, He's got a sense tablet, of humor. Your laptop, your computer. It's the software, that unseen part that really is what gives these devices okay so this was in june he recorded this helps us to so i'm gonna click into his videos and i'm gonna go to one of his like most recent videos and see if he's oh that's a live stream let's try this one he's pretty pretty knowledgeable the jews murmured about jesus because he said i am always the bread with the that jews came down from heaven and they said oh, like is jews. this not jesus the son of joseph do we not know his father and his mother then how can he say, I have come down from heaven? Jesus answered and he said to them, Stop. That's the one thing I haven't done yet. Eat. Is my Hebrew jokes. Oh, here he comes. I'm not sure I have any. i got to write some. But if you see, so my, you see my curls, right? Yeah, not she's saying hi. In your hair? It's our yeah, little two-year anniversary. Curl no, no but I curl up okay. the sides. And oh, no, I have not seen like that. a rabbi? No, okay. I've not seen that. Yeah, Father I'm a Francis rabbi here. here with you on this uh, on 19th Sunday in Ordinary Time. Most of my and Jewish friends like it. And I am doing like a walk-and-talk video, and there's a reason for that. It's because I can actually walk. I think so. I would probably lay off that one. I have been... I want to take this Unless you're going like to maybe full on parody, kind of my <laughs> full condition. on, and uh, I don't want to get uh, too lost in the weeds over this. So uh, yeah, he's just doing it on his like he's tablet. Like a, you know, he's vlogging, um, um, but it uh, appears it. that cool. I've had some kind of a bad reaction. I'm thinking to a vaccine that I had. Oh, uh, get out of here. It started about four and a half months ago. You did not get a vaccine when you're 90 years old. Okay. Okay, here we got another one. Holy smoking pipe padre. What? Ho, ho, ho. It's Santa here. A very, very Christmas. This looks Santa awesome. Santa Claus, yeah. it's snowing. He's, He's got, got a, a big ass Gandalf pipe. It's as long <laughs> as my fucking arm. Look at it. Is it the same He's getting guy? 400 viewers. <laughs> Is it the I'm same sorry, priest? That's just me being hey. racist. Look at this. All right. Howdy, my bell. 
Yeah, I'm like a kid with a new toy. I love that pipe. Okay, back here again, receiving. And uh, let's see where, where we're at here. We got the old back uh, 40 there. What? There's, there's where I was on the the iMac what? earlier today. Probably using the tablet and, uh, or something let's go back again over here. too. Flipping around the camera. There I am. He's got a okay. series of pipes. We're live again. Now this is just a. I did not obviously schedule this one, and it's a little bit after eight o'clock. And uh, so. So my idea is with these vloggers, like this guy obviously looks like he's yeah. kind of opinionated, no longer vegan. Uh, 43 and, uh, minutes, uh, holy shit. Yeah, but he's doing like a live stream. Yeah, this is a popular so format. People do and sit here and He's kind got of, a lot of yeah. subscribers too, 4,000. But uh, that's cool. I, I do like his Still feeling pretty Sherlock. Good. Very stylish, very classy. I like it. Apprehensive, you know. Kind I of kind of well. think like with people this like this, the, the, the angle would be to interview them, take effect, like because they talk exactly for like forty three minutes. You know, you could kind of just uh, sit and listen, yeah, and then figure out what they're trying and, to say, uh, and then kind of interview them in a way that helps them the actually thing, communicate Thursday. what they're trying to say a little Wednesday, bit better. Thursday, Friday, and then all you know what I mean? Because it's hard sometimes when you're just talking, you get lost, you go over here. You know, but so if somebody yeah, like if somebody's heard your forty five minute point you know, if it's a shop, and then they can kind of like direct you through an interview time. or something like that to like yeah, really kind of just lay it out. And yeah. Out and when you start the tangent yeah. kinda like pull you back in or something, you know? Yeah. Um, um so there's some real interesting guys I watch. Uh, I don't this new IOS uh, I don't particularly find this guy super interesting. IOS but test. there are like for uh, one, there's one guy no longer um, and we if I bring up his name we're gonna have to play it and, <laughs> and I just want to stick to Chico I did that, but most of you know there's I, one I guy in particular that I just world. he's got like one video that's really blowing and up and the rest this, of his aren't really I, I have, I do have a and lot it's kind of like for, this where it's like 45 for, for minutes long or something and he's like talking and it can be tightened you know, up, but not. I don't think it needs to be edited. To but I think if, if ones, the same topic I, came I out really through conversation instead of one guy trying to tell the story, exactly, that the, it's easier for the audience to get the, the fuller the message. Vegan hmm. Does that make sense? sense? Yeah, just to have uh, at least for this, you know, like a forum of group of guys this, talking this about it back and forth. Evolutionary cycle. Of or just me and them. 45 minutes, that's that's long for one person to just be staring at a camera. Like These guys do it like every day, though. That's how they build their audiences. And that's cool. I mean, it's <laughs> just, wow, 45 minutes. Fucking, like, Theo Vaughn and stuff, and Joe Rogan, they, well, Theo and, like... Yeah, but Joe Rogan is a group of guys yeah, talking about it. Yeah, but Theo's usually one, if you watch him. He kind of, like, do it. There's a bunch of guys who are... Do you know the Bill Burr podcast, how that thing goes? So he just, I don't think he's on video, he might be, but it's just him, and he just like br brain rattles shit all day, and okay. he's like funny. And so he's kind of built some success doing that, and now a lot of the other younger comedians, Chris D'Elia has a channel, uh, Theo Vaughn, he's, he's, Theo Vaughn's popular, he goes on Rogan, he has a Netflix nice. special, but he's, he's doing it on YouTube, and they get like... 10,000 viewers a day or something. It's like not That's huge cool. numbers, but what happens is they're building their audience, building their audience. Theo Vaughn got a sponsorship that plays at the beginning of one of his episodes from a fucking pizza shop in Bend, Oregon. Wow. And so I hit them up yesterday and was like, hey, I saw that when I was fucking watching Theo's show. Like, if we come through to Bend, we're going to stop by and see you. And then they wrote me back, right? Oh, yeah, you have to, yada, yada. That's cool. Hell yeah. That's really cool. Hell yeah. So, all right, let's get going. Milky Way Weekly. Is this a real channel? Something happens here when I think people, like, use proxies or something. They're not really in this place, but their, like, upload point is. But this guy... <clears throat> wow, is this guy real? I don't know. These videos look weird. They're very strange. Uh, thumbnails. If you enjoy my work, please tell your friends. Milky Way Weekly. Okay, so he wants to be contacted. That's a good sign. He'll probably be thrilled when we do. <laughs> he 
keep your sight on the light. A music video? Mm -hmm. Not sure. There's music. But like this is kind of what you were just saying earlier. Just take a lot of just kind of nature foot, but cut it up with the live band. You know? Yeah, but these are also just still images. I meant like you know your camera, which is yeah, amazing. Yeah. I thought they were mine. I guess not. Oh yeah, well, that one is. That's a video. But I'm just saying, yeah, we could do. I know what you're. Saying. Yeah, we could we could outdo this. Absolutely. But this is the idea. Take B-roll, cool shots. Why would you even make a fucking music video to this song? I kinda wanna just meet this person. <laughs> to ask them why. Yeah. Hey, like your video was really great. I liked all your shots. Your photos are cool. But why did you why did you make it this song? I need to see the catfish reveal. Also, did they film this footage? Cause I hope so. Else, what's the point? <laughs> it's gotta be their footage, at least. Alright, back to the channel. They're getting likes. Yeah. Milky Way Weekly. They got a lot of Buddha stuff. I like that. This is Brian here from Milky Way Weekly. This is the same guy? And I've got a special guest. I would have never Sue guessed G, it. And uh, we're going to be talking about intuition, psychic abilities, and interdimensional integration. And what wow. is the difference? Or okay, is well, I'm a volunteer at the Portland Psychedelic see? Society, so I wonder what I have in contact with this guy. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hell yeah. Um, while I'm trying to mute this, why don't you give us a quick overview of we can get an astral family discount. Okay, well, this <laughs> came up because, because you and I were talking, or have been talking maybe about intuition. Accidental you know, alchemy? You know, you're All right. Kind of it's this guy. I'm going to write to him for sure. Recently, or your psychic ability, or your... And these are all in the California area. Sort of how everybody's path is different. Different uh, I Psychic hope he's still in Chico. Kind of Should be. Hey, I am a volunteer. Most of the people no, how about this? Are, I am all, the media manager. Portland Psychedelic Society. Found your video. Looking. For what YouTubers is psychic, what is intuition, what is the difference to collab this stuff, so. with, you know, like I we will be in Chico now. Really varies person to person, you know. It's your own interpretation of it. How about this? Yeah. I'm just going to say, hey, I'm the media it's, manager. It's Maybe this is too much. For I want to leave I want to leave a comment guys, here and tell him kind of who I am, it's, and it's, then I'm going to hit him up at his email it's, it's something that can't and then be like, hey, this so is our fuller plan. I don't want to tell him too much here. You know, I just want to like kind of like say hi. How about this? Hey, I'm the... How about this? Hey, I'm the media manager. You guys... Then that's quantifying, but otherwise just... Like for me, growing up, Subscribe. learning to listen How to about my, that? There to we my go. inner self, to, it took a lot of a lot of years. I, I'm still to this day. I don't. Cool. You know, I will sometimes question what I'm getting in my inner knowing. Well, I mean, I think we all do, you know, because it's relatively. I know for me, it's it's new. You know, well, you know, actually, no. P.S. The reason I was like, we only have so much time. I got to go record you know, an event over you there know, for Ibo Me. Have you ever heard of that, that stuff? Like when, no. I was it's getting like into meditation the crazy question, fuck. You know, it's like the craziest psychedelic. It it's like self. from Africa. It's and like an ancient was, tree, and it just you get fucked up. It like cures you from African tree. It cures you from heroin and shit. What? And it also kills one in eight hundred people who try it and, and all that ties That's together crazy. and you know 
like I said, in this community, and it's like, especially, yeah. I truly do think it kind of sounds like ayahuasca. But that's funny. I oh, was yeah. making inappropriate well, everybody, Black Panther. Everybody joke. Has that's that's everybody cool, has. though. It's I mean, just a matter of, of opening, ibogaine. Opening it up. Ibogaine? Okay, well, hell yeah. Like some I already know this guy's up my alley. Uh, I was a little in question with the music video, but that we have music videos in common and mm. this kind of psychic abilities and intuition. I'm down for this guy. I really hope you're in Chico, bro. I'm gonna email you later. <clears throat> Vlock. Vlock Warrior. This channel doesn't have any content. That's cool. Probably a kid. Yeah. See you, kid. Oh, wow. Look at that. Shaved decay in his chest hair. <laughs> it's all about his kid, though. I don't really. I mean, I love kids, but. Kids. I'm gonna go ahead and pass on you for now, Kev, unless I see a video of you shaving the K. <laughs> which I just fucked up and clicked something, so we're off him. Joel. Oh, this is a very. from elementary school. Wow. Nope. Not on this channel. This is probably this is probably one of those I was talking about where it's like not really there. Sex toy Johnny boy. Is this a music video? Probably also. <coughs> I don't know to be determined. I want to say no. his cursors on the screen that's not ours really yeah he's recording a screen with a camera that's why you're getting those glares What the fuck is even going on? I'm like lost. I guess I'm captivated because so I can't look away. I'm like, I'm like, okay, what is this? I'm still. He's hungry, but he doesn't want popsicles. <laughs> He's tired, but he doesn't want to sleep in a big, comfortable ass bed. to shit but he doesn't want to do it sitting down <laughs> so funny that's not our mouse cursor Isn't what the hilarious? fuck <laughs> yeah, look funny. if you want to have beautiful hair you gotta take care of yourself man that's true Neutrogena this is a commercial at the end it's gonna be like bye proactive You know, maybe maybe this. three strokes of the hair would have been appropriate at it. <laughs> How much longer? Oh, it's at the end. Ten There's seconds. Still... Now the sex toy. Okay. How interesting. <sighs> Let's go ahead and see if you got anything up here. Because that was... That was weird. But I guess, I mean, we just watched a day in the life of sex toy Johnny Boy. How's it going? Jonathan Godino here. This one is specifically requested by my beloved fans. Before anything, safety's first. We got our safety glasses. 
Uh, we got two layers of sheets. So my dog who's behind that sheet too. So there's four layers to protect my dog. So don't say I do bad things so I don't deserve my pet. My, my pet. Here, you show already know the scripture whenever you're in the way. Like I said, we got two layers. We got a towel right here. You think he's an actor? Let's get it started, right? Jonathan Gadino. Ah. What the fuck is happening? Why is he breaking these bottles for no reason? Maybe this is the B-roll. For the music video. So, he lives in this RV camper and he's With breaking the dog. bottles. Is this Rumble in the Bronx? What's going on? Dude's just smashing all those bottles we saw. He got pissed off, man. They're bad actors. It's weird. Sometimes they both explode and sometimes one explodes. Oh, fuck. You're gonna do it with your head, dude. Out of everything the Sprite survived, <laughs> it won the Royal Rumble. Look at that. Sprite wins! We got here. We made, we made magic, magic God. God. Not a sweep it up. With that shitty broom. <laughs> yeah, like I said, this one was for Cassie. I don't, I don't take, take requ requests. requests. So, so enjoy, enjoy this. this. I hope y'all enjoyed. enjoy it. Y'all have a good day. Okay, I'm gonna write Melcy out on the screen. Ha ha ha, how many did you step on later? Are you from Chico? Where is first comment, second like, fourth view? Unique, I guess. Now I'll meet up with that case. guy. He's good, cause we can do some like, you know, you said shoot some like B-roll and shit, yeah. you know? Like, we'll use that in a music video, that'll go good. <laughs> the breaking of like 30 bottles. <laughs> At That's least. little kid. Alright, little kid, see you, see you little willy. Probably in... DJ not, skip and jack your talk at CSU. School stuff. Not interested. The Manimals, this looks like a band. With two videos. Oh, Maltese, that's where we're going to play our show. Really? Yep. So this is the place we're going to be playing our show in Chico. Little stage. Well, it's not too small. It's off the floor, at least. That's good. Hell yeah. That guy's got some good knee bend action. <laughs> we had an hour 45, so probably about 50 minutes. So I'm going to leave these guys a comment. And then we got, looks like about seven or eight more. We can just zip through, though. A lot of them are probably kids and shit, so. 
All right, man. Are you gonna use all fifty minutes? Probably. What? I mean, maybe not completely. I might go take a second look at the. Should have been more careful with. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna take a little look at that (laughs) second look. But if it's not too bad, if I feel like I can defend it, you know what I mean? Like, hey, fuck off. But yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We're men, dude. Fuck those people who. think that we're in trouble for the know, for I having guess, the thoughts guess. that we have you know what i mean like here we are trying to figure it out between how hey how do you feel how do we feel oh we yeah. can't even talk we have to walk a balance beam even amongst each other That's comfortably true. it's kind of bullshit <clears throat> and i always get in trouble for saying for ow get in trouble for saying moderately innocent things so I might as well say something foul just say it fucking so foul and be accountable for it and you know like it sorry I said it it's not it's not because you say it because you're trying to like perpetrate somebody with it it's just just fucking words man words are just tiny mouth noises okay Mark Lilly five days learning real estate well real guess estate. what mark lily just so happens i happen to be co-owner of a fucking real estate company davenport iowa how about that i might know a little bit something for you maybe you could oh yeah that's that's what he's doing real estate here we go am i going to become a real estate agent sure five minutes Mm, let's check this one out first. Six months ago. So this guy's just a hey vlogger. Guys, I am back. Still, Still trying, trying to find to a find video guy. I got like all of them come and help, help out. out. Um, so, so if, if you, you are, are a video, video guy, guy or you know a video guy, guy you should hit me up. What? L i l l e y p a d. Here we go. Y o o l s at gmail.com and uh, let me know uh, I am for a now, video guy uh, I am coming to really, Chico my California and my great grandkids to kind of see in October yeah, on tour started, with a uh, band kind of going helping through YouTube takes, uh, creators make you know, better fighting it content for just, just over and a year coming up on a year and two months collaborate so, it's uh, oh, yeah. a long, hard struggle. Excited to Everybody see makes it this. seem like entrepreneurship's easy. I will send easy. you an email. Uh, it's just really not. So, uh, but for the right people, bam, it's worth it. That's a, see, yeah, like yeah. that. That's somebody yeah, who want wants to be share, hit up, share, right? Share it doesn't you have to be really like really that imposing. Was kids. That was like oh really what about whatever, whatever. Yeah, however many generations from now hell yeah uh, okay see this, uh, <laughs> we there. we didn't even so okay we are gonna fill up our full hour we didn't do any so like i had a whole value. series of words we could search for more than to, just like how try to, to find some better cool shit things, we're barely like, gonna get through this but that's okay because about. just going through this we probably hit up what five or six people at least already yeah and all we really need to do is meet one to like meet make the standard of this tour yeah, and we want it to be a variety, so we I don't. Still think the skate kids would be a good choice. Hell yeah! That, that oh movie. hell yeah! Just we could just go hang out at that. Sk- the thing. Okay, here's here's the only downside of the skate park, and it's not even a downside. It's just like when you have. You know, you're right. It, it, my I just fucking my own thinking. I own, I contradicted it before That's I even fun. had to make the argument. I, what I was gonna say is. We were playing at a bar, and what we're most likely to meet is kids under 21, so we wouldn't have a draw that night, but even better, probably, because then they wouldn't get to go to this show. They would want to go to the show. Yeah. And then... then the skate park's good, dude. Hell Especially yeah. Especially if you're filming. Hell yeah. Video. I want to get a portable amp, too, so that they can just play anywhere. George got, like, a battery-powered one. Something like that. It was crazy. Okay, B attack. Zero strings. <laughs> Confusing. It is Should we a lot of people about like his fucking bees won't let me in my truck. His superpower? I'm usually not a pussy about this. I like his language. Oh boy. He's just going for it. 
This dude's got balls. This is fucking Steve-O. <laughs> um, that was the whole video. <laughs> yeah. That video, we can help you make better B videos. Smoking purring. Just gonna click that forward a few seconds. Everybody loves dog content. Our viewership <laughs> just went up right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm just going to pass on her because we have better, I would say. Things I feel more excited about. Okay, massage. I would definitely be down to get a massage. So, Creating a sustainable you. Look at this. CBD topicals. Woo! How to safely use an inversion table. Creating a sustainable you. Mother's Day is coming. Okay. Should we say why should you get a massage or creating a sustainable you? Uh, the sustainable you. Okay. 30 seconds. Yes. I'm on board with that. Nice and tight. Hi. My name is Candy Williamson. Hi, Candy. I'm massaged by Candy, and I'm introducing creating a sustainable you. Here, we're creating a space with therapists who specialize in helping you get better. It typically takes more than one thing to help I love her background. It reminds me of mine. We're now that reminds me classes, with the velvet curtain, well like, there's going to be some couch back there, and suddenly it's going to be the casting couch. You're going to be like, well, Carlos. Hell yeah, I do that on Fridays. Be, <laughs> <laughs> you can be like, you want to be on the channel. Da, da, That's my da, dating da. life. <laughs> <laughs> Friday, come over. I got an audition. I'm just got kidding. Audition. Okay, I'm going to hit her up because she's doing the right kind of stuff. I liked her, but I accidentally... Well, there's probably a way. Oh, shit. Yeah. Hold on. Reopen. Look at that. Life hack number one right there when you're doing this. Reopen, close tab, got too high. Hi. I'm going to listen to the last 17 seconds because I tuned out while we were laughing. I want to know how to be sustainable. Yoga, I want to live forever. Classes, as well as we have a myofascial specialist in house, a variety of massage modalities, tools, and even supplements to help you feel your best. Come on down and check us out. All right. Well, ready to try and, already time traveled just so I could <coughs> beer in the modern age. Want to live forever. There we go. Let's see if that leads anywhere. That one was kind of like just kind of asking for it though. Like, hey, I'm just going to be there. Do you want to do it? Yeah. Wasn't as, wasn't as uh, soft of a touch, you know. Yeah, the soft of the, the psychedelic guy was more. This oh, is a very young see, girl. Tour director. Well, I'm a tour manager. Let's see. Hello, my name is Kari, and welcome to. Hi, Bill Kari. Park. Bidwell Park is located in Chico, California. The okay. park is over 3,000 acres, this park. which makes it three times larger than San Francisco's Golden Gate Park. What? And nearly four times as big as New York Central Park. We gotta go to the this park. The park has many activities, hiking and biking, and of course swimming on the many summer days where it's well over 100 degrees. We should have those bike kids tearing it up on this park. <laughs> fun and engaging, yet calm and adaptable. I am anxious to interact with your guests to bring your destinations to life. I look forward to hearing from you soon so we can further discuss how my specialized skill set would be an asset to your company. Thank you. Uh, I don't think she's going to really do anything for a motor coat, to be honest. But we're going to go to that park. Okay, this is one that's like in a different language and shit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wharf racing. What awesome. is that? Well, it depends. Oh, he's Wharf. Robert Wharf. Yeah. So okay. Is it Here's a 23 second. Let's see. Some of those. <laughs> yeah, my grandpa. 
Party Suit uh, Drag Race or whatever. Just drive your car in circles? Okay. That's awesome. Are there any races in October? Creates a little mystery. Okay, one video, no subscribers. Are you even trying, bro? Hey guys, I'm back again with another video. Um, another? I only saw the one. <laughs> this week I had football, and it fucking sucked. He had what? He said he played football. Like, he had football. Like, he plays football. Yeah. Okay. He had football. Okay. I kind of just want to pass on this one. Yeah, I can't like, tell if that guy's, like, mentally handicapped and, and because we were already trying to get this line here, I don't want him discussing. I don't want any, <laughs> I don't want any concussion controversy here on this channel. <laughs> no, nothing about concussions. <laughs> I'm intrigued. I don't know what this is. More sustainability, man. That's a yeah. buzzword in Chico. Sustainability. I think this is a fake video. Like, I'm drinking water out of a mason jar. I'm... We're almost done, though. Okay, here we got another it. vlogger. Let's see. Introduction to my channel. So this is, he'll tell us everything Welcome right here. to the introduction to my channel. So this is like, <laughs> I'm going to tell you what my channel is about, what we're going to be doing, everything Look at me. and the fun and the just love and happiness that we're going to spread through my channel. Hell yes. And yeah, starting off. So my channel is going to be about like the hardships of life, like okay. anxiety, depression, losing somebody, grieving, um being faced with PTSD, looking life in the eye and saying, I can do better. I know I'm better than this. And my future job title is going to be a public speaker. Okay. So this is going to be like I deal with me public starting speakers. off that life. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's going to be me starting off this life of a public speaker is me talking to you guys every day for the next however long my channel goes on and Showing okay, well that was on July 30th. No views. Same thing along the way. For the first view. How is there a like? Was I there... liked it. Oh, I was like, how is there one like but there's not any views? That doesn't make sense. <laughs> how is it? No, okay, I got it. And then he didn't do it every day. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Lamb God here with another video. So we're going to be checking the mail to see if. Hold on, wait a second. Did he say Lamb God? Yes. In the last one, he was Lamb King with zero views. Now he's Lamb God with one view. <laughs> it's working. The package came. Yes, I'm looking for a package from Wish, the one, the only Wish. I bought some things off of there. And we're going to see if they came today. If they did, dope. They didn't. It's okay because we got a lot of time to waste. A lot of things to do. <laughs> And yeah, I did my morning workout. I did some cleaning around my house. So let's get it. Okay, hold let's on. Let's get it. You oh, got check the mail. his persona completely changed, right? Was yes. that a joke? I don't, I don't know. Okay. I don't, I don't understand. Let's go check this mail. He's like a different person. I gotta check it just to make sure that it ain't here yet. So let's go. There wasn't any mail. No mail at all. Sad, sad, sad life. But you know what? Now he's the original guy. Don't care anymore. Uh, so I realized I haven't updated you guys on like what I've been doing, but I've just been watching Netflix, chilling, <laughs> Hell yeah, with my bro. fidget spinner. Hell yeah! You know, I'm just trying to do some fidget.
I don't know, man. That's it. About it. It's all I've been doing. So, yeah. This is going to be the end of the vlog. Roll the outro now. If you guys enjoyed that video, if you guys didn't, please like, comment, and subscribe no to outro. me and my assortment <laughs> of things that I do. I play with fidget spinners. I play with things that are out of date. I do things that you guys don't really usually see. I do the boring things. I watch Netflix. I chill. So, yeah. Let's yeah, get we, we don't see a lot of chilling Netflix or fidget spinners. Guys got, dude. I'm glad we tuned in. This kid's very young. this guy <laughs> okay I already wrote to this guy before you got here this was the first one I st I clicked on let's see maybe someday Constantine I think it's just a still image in a song and he's like a musician rapper R&B guy Hashtag Tupac, hashtag Drake, hashtag Tech Nine, hashtag Eminem, hashtag XXXstinction, <laughs> hashtag Snoop Dogg, hashtag Dr. Dre. He was just the first one that came up, and I just was like testing my system. I was like, I'm just gonna email him right now. We can get onto something fresh. We don't need to make it on something I already seen. Oh yeah, well, I really, I think that was a success. The best one. You did this before I got him. Yeah. We just sat here for 50 minutes, and this is the best one. Before I got here. Yeah, no, he already called me. Actually, we already got it lined up. Dangling the line of being accepted in society, and this was the best one that already happened. Save best for last. Hell yeah. Well, we got like five or six I think I hit up. We're gonna get this close. Hell yeah. I'm, I'm confident. I think this went well. Yeah. I got what I needed out of it. I, I liked it. Know. There were some good ones. I like the skate kids, the psychedelic person. Um, this one I really like already. The possibility of, like I said, uh, especially if you, I mean, I don't know if you already have footage. You know, uh, rolling, filming yeah, stuff when you guys get out there, it. filming, going to that park maybe, filming stuff when yeah, you get out there, park. footage from Chico, uh, rolling it, these guys are going to want stuff from their area. They yeah. How do you feel about the podcast itself or whatever? Um, participating. I, li I like it. I like it as far as sitting here and going over these. Um, you know, this was specific, obviously, about, you know, uh, your trip down there. Yeah. But obviously, you, you know, there's different subjects and things you can broach or go over, you know, I, I like the idea, you know, going over the videos. Because I got to do about 10 more of these cities, so that's why I'm like trying to make the cre the content around I have to do this work myself. Yeah. It's um, kind of like a... Do you think we could open it up in some way to like make it... It's almost like the, what is it, uh... Is it the behind the scenes? Almost like the behind the scenes where, you know what I mean, like... Because you are going on the tour, and you are having the bands, you are going to be making videos, you made awesome videos for us already, and this was us just kind of doing the research, you know what right. I mean? What's right. going on, you're going to find some people, maybe make some kick-ass video, music video, something, uh, whatever, you know what I mean? Whatever you do, right. it doesn't have to be music-based, ultimately, <laughs> but I mean, it sounds like it will be. This one, the skate parks, the rock band, Yeah, I mean, this was a good, I found enough. Some of these people are going to hit us back, but what I guess I'm asking you, I'll ask you again, is like... The podcast. Yeah, like this setup, because, you know, we could do another one, or I could just start asking other comedians, but either yeah. way, I would like to know, like, how we can make it a little bit better from, you know, the guests, uh, you know, so that you can have a better time, or, like, feel like you got more out of it or something, or got the most out of it. Um, I'm not sure, you know what I mean? It's, I, I, think, I think people would be... Especially you know, other comedians. Do you think you got to talk enough? Oh, I'm sure I definitely did. I think I, know I, I, think I was, subjects. quite frankly, probably too stoned to talk more. At some point, I was worried I wasn't talking enough, quite frankly. So, I mean, you know what I mean? People that might be more uh, 
Yeah, we did sucked out two joints we pretty did, quick. We did. We did. Those will shut me up. Like people know. That's, that's, uh, people tell me I talk a lot, and then I s- s- smoke, and then I don't talk at all. But no. So um, <laughs> right. aside so from that, I felt I felt that I didn't talk enough. But you know what I mean, like that. That people okay. can probably come up with their own witty little quips about this and Do that. Do you think that um, you had enough chances to be funny? Yes. Okay. Yes. Hell yeah. I do. I tried to come up with some things. Even uh, that's what I'm saying. Some of it was dancing on the borderline. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we got um, it off there pretty quick, but that's okay. Um, but uh, <laughs> that'll be the, all our views come in for that. I really do think, like, let's say. George, or you know what I mean? He, he'd fucking he'd have some outrageous shit to say, you know what I mean? To yeah. some of this, and it would I've asked, uh, be... you know, Ross, Ross, Ross Pasek, yeah, yeah. I asked him if he would, yeah, but he's I haven't good heard back from him yet. He's he's good, but he, he keeps asking out. me, like, he wants to do like skits and stuff, okay. you know. But like, this here's the thing when That's you do cool. when you make your content this way, how we just did it here, yeah, we didn't have to write anything. No, right. All we had to do is sit here for an hour, and we made an episode. And so, yeah. if we were able to, what I mean, whatever. Some of my shit gets 300 views. Most of it doesn't. Mo- like that's kind of like my ceiling right now. But I can, I'm seeing the curve. I can, views is good. I can show you my <clears throat> analytics. It goes like it's trending upwards. You know, it's obvious. What happens is at the beginning you just don't have anything, right? Yeah. So then once you like start to have something. Uh, so then you start to get views when you post something, and then the next phase is those those videos. Once you have enough of them, and in enough, uh, as say the difference between five and having fifteen. Once you have fifteen, um, the you, even these back videos are getting a few views every day. Right, right. So there's say. like a, the floor gets lifted a little bit by just like what keeps coming in off of the back trail. But as you keep building. And that keeps getting better. The back trail keeps, you know, sweeping up with it, basically, too. Yeah. And the opportunity, hopefully... I mean, think of all the opportunities we may have just lined up right here in an hour. Yeah, that's true. And we made our content for the day. Yeah. For, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. it's awesome. It's kind of awesome. It is. But that's why I like that. Because, like I said, uh, not only did you make the content, but it's kind of like... You know what I mean? Uh, in the making of, because this is really just what goes into right. part. Of, it's even a fraction of what goes on into my English. channel. Is what we're doing is how to book a tour. So I'm setting yeah. up the instructional how I'm actually doing the shit, there you go. so that you can do it too. There right? Exactly. Yeah. Right. Cause Cause that's, that's what you're reiterating. That's what's like, no, that's fine. That's what's going on. You know what I mean? It's what's going on behind the scenes, meeting people, yeah, making content. Meeting people to help each other create right. better content. I mean, I met you like two or three months ago or something yeah. like that. And this, so we're making a video. Hell yeah. We're making a video. I've made some. I, I, I swear somewhere along the way I just thought we were just like testing a video. And then I'm like, are you using this? And you're like, yeah. And you're like, every minute? Yeah. And you're like, you're probably going to use this part too. And I was like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever. It ain't too bad. I'll look. No, at I it. love it. I if love I the think idea. If it is, I won't. You I, know, love... I won't like hang you up. To drive. <laughs> I think something went too bad, but I don't think it was too bad. I love. I it, think though. we. I think what got. I think what the audience will see. You know, some people are just going to be dicks and be like, "Oh, you're not even allowed to like think of those thoughts." But I think what most audience will see is that we had we had a really uncomfortable time tiptoeing around it. Yeah, uh, you even though we were some, trying to yeah. be kind of offensive, we still couldn't be. Yeah. Because they have us by the balls even when they're not in our fucking room because they're in our head. Yeah. I think that's what will be seen. So, uh, anyway, yeah, that's yeah. the episode. Chico, we, we'll see you when we get there. Fucking A. Peace.